Hi, in this video I'm going to be reviewing the Mindset DIY servo control board kit for use with an ESC and a trolling motor. That being said, let's go ahead and get started. This is what comes in the package when you first open it up. It's got this nice illustrated manual with a step-by-step -step instruction guide this 10k pot this three conductor ribbon wire which I'm not going to use and this 9 volt battery connection for the servo board which I'm also not going to use because it is powered by the ESC and then here is the circuit board along with the three pin connector This is a close-up shot of the top of the circuit board. Now, it's clearly marked, which makes things a lot easier. If you look to this side here, it says pot, and it's got the three holes for your wiring that you're going to put in there. And then on this side, it's the servo, which is going to be for the three-pin connector. And it explains it in the manual, but just so you know, there's a little white dot here that you can probably just barely see right next to this pin connection spot and that's going to be for your signal wire so that will help you orient everything when you put it together this is what the completed board looks like now on the top here you've got your plus and minus for the battery but since I'm not using it I left that open and on this side are the three connections for the pot and I've used the traditional yellow for the signal red for the positive voltage and black for the ground or negative negative. and you're gonna see that little dark part in there and what that is is some liquid electrical tape and I just put that on there just to keep the connections tight and waterproof now on this side I've got my servo connected and again, you can see that this dot here signifies the signal line, which is the color here for my setup. And then, of course, the ground is on the opposite side there. This is an overall view of my test setup. I have my previously modified Newport Vessels 36-pound thrust trolling motor that has the Hobby Wing Quick Run 880 ESC mounted in the head unit and to the left of the screen is a previously built speed controller using a 10k center detent pot which I'm going to be using in this instead of the one that was supplied with the kit and then right next to the controller is the PC board all connected and ready to be tested I wanted to provide a closer view of the setup down there is the speed controller and that has three conductors which are then attached here to where the output is for the potentiometer on this board and then of course have the connection going to the servo that's inside this head unit I've previously made all the connections with the power so all I need to do now is turn on the ESC and show you that it works. So that's it, it works like it should. Overall, I want to say I'm really satisfied with this kit. I found it after hours of searching online and somehow just came up on their website and found this. And this is exactly what most of the people who like using the ESCs for the trolling motor have been looking for. That way you don't have to go through so many servo boards frying them until you get one that finally works. 
and the quality is excellent the instruction manual is excellent and despite the fact that it came from overseas I got it in two days so I'm very happy with the way this project turned out so that's it if you have any questions please leave them for me in the comments thank you